Don't give up what you want most for what you want now. What's up guys, just got home from school today. Almost finished with that, but today I received my first car package. Like, we've received car packages before and it's always like Christmas opening up, but this, this is like my first car package I've got. I've wanted this for like a while now. It wasn't like the longest I've waited for something, but it was, it was a while and super, super hard to get. I didn't think I would get it. In fact, I didn't even order it. It was crazy how it came across. I'll get into depth with that later. But let's just get into it, man. I'm gonna show you guys. I opened up, I opened it up from the bigger box it came in. So it was like, of course, like the bigger shipping box, so you can't see what's on the side. But it's like, ooh, baby. Of course, they throw in a couple stickers for you. We've got a Vertex sticker, Fat Lace collaboration. I don't know if you can see it. This one's pretty legit. I want to throw that on the back window sometime. This one's probably like my favorite. It says Legends Never Die. It's got that reflective, super nice, super clean. This one's tight too. Uh, I'm not gonna stick that on anything, probably just gonna keep it, but it has like that old school TV look almost. And then, the package, baby. Ooh, there she is. Oh, she. Stopped it on accident, my bad. Right, so this was bubble wrapped. I just took that out right now. Oh, it's coming out. Oh my God. So clean. Front side, mean street. I want to play with the settings really quickly, see if I can get you guys to be able to see the front side details, but it's not going to let me while I'm recording. Uh, let's see if I sign. There we go. So it is embroidered suede. I mean, not the nicest material, but it is absolutely gorgeous in hands and it feels great. I, of course, prefer carbon fiber, but I'm not gonna be able to find a steering wheel like this in carbon fiber. But that is legit. That legitness. So cool. It is a deep 330 millimeter BBS wheel. It's got other stuff inside here. Tags. And here's the horn. There's a beautiful little horn. There she goes. She's gonna snap, and I don't want to snap her in right now, but there it is. Oh, what the heck? Let's just put it in. All right, so it just slides in, just like that. Very nice. Very cool. It is a limited edition steering wheel, so it's numbered one out of or 40 out of 100. Wish I had 100. <laughs> Number one. Or 100, that'd be legit. But I am super content with this. This detail work is just amazing. Fat lace, the quality, they're always popping out. Just good content, good quality. This stuff's super cool. Yeah, there's a little horn. Going super well with the colorway I wanna go with. A little sneak peek action. All right, I know when like, you buy something, you don't want to sound dumb and be like, oh, I really don't like it or anything, or, or people just like over-exaggerate and be like, oh, I absolutely love it. But I'm just being completely honest. I honestly think I was supposed to buy this steering wheel because I was on Instagram the other day and I had purchased something that goes along with it. And I had this idea of it, but I didn't think I would end up with both of them. But that was my idea was to get them both, but I didn't think I would. Because the first time I went on Osteezy, let me try to find them, sorry. Yeah, okay, so his name's Osteezy. He has an Instagram page, and how I found him, my brother used to have an IS300, and I would always encourage him, like, oh, you should fix up your car and keep it clean like him. And 
that never happened. And then he ended up getting rid of it, but he had an RX-7 as well. And it was pretty legit because I liked his artwork and his content. And my dad has an RX-7 too. This is what the car parts are going to. Like, yeah, most of the car parts. I mean, the steering wheel is obviously mine. Yes, I'm selfish. He's got his own now. No, he's already got his own. This is mine. But came across him, RX-7, uh, sticker work. And I came across this. As childish as it is, I just fell in love with it. They're called like Pikachu, like, right, stickers. And I wanted to put one on my dash, like really, really bad. And I put two and two together, kind of, right? So I got the sticker and I actually wanted to purchase the sticker. So when I first saw the sticker, I wanted to see it and it was out of stock. It sold out and I was pissed off because I had it in my cart. I went to work and I came back to it and it was sold out. It was like, sorry, not available kind of deal. It's like, damn dude, they're probably not gonna restock kind of deal and I was bummed out. And he restocked his website. First thing I did was buy the sticker like ASAP. I was like, I just want the sticker. And I went to the website to see if they still had the steering wheel. And the steering wheel was sold out as well. Like it was, it was gone completely. And my hopes were just kind of crushed, you know? It was on like Fat Lay's Big Cartel, like collect everything. And I went back on there because I had checked a couple weeks earlier. I went back on, sold out, and I was bummed. I was like, dang. So I sent a picture of my uh, my sticker I had bought to my dad. And I was like, oh, I just picked up the sticker, unfortunately, because I told him about the idea. I was like, unfortunately, steering wheel sold out. Sold out. And he was like, oh, well, there's, uh, he texted me back. Oh, there's always a silver lining in the cloud. I was like, what are you talking about kind of deal, you know? Like, what do you mean there's a silver lining? I'm not going to be able to get that back. A like sold out kind of deal. Most people don't like to sell, resell it for a while if they're going to. And he eventually like told me he's like, oh, I had purchased it because he didn't want me going around the internet and like trying to buy another one. Stuck with two, I wouldn't mind, but just having two is kind of ridiculous. But anyway, he got the steering wheel. I was stoked about it, and then I started looking at the steering wheel. Like as soon as I opened it, I started noticing right now about the colorways of the steering wheel like I start checking it out and like has a lot of gold has a lot of yellow and of course I got the Pikachu one in it I noticed that like the lightning bolts when I first wanted the steering wheel I was like okay that's pretty cool like it, it matches like legends never die I always thought like Pikachu since I was a kid I've always liked Pikachu he's like my legend kind of deal so legends never die and it has like these pretty sick lightning bolts on it all around the steering wheel and then it's the colorway matches but then I remember these like back in the day my dad picked these up at Jack in the Box like 1999, that's like when I was born, like by coincidence. And so it's like a, how would you say, chrome red? Chrome red and like it opens super smooth, it's pretty legit. It's legitness! Yeah. And then it has this gold Pikachu in it. So I was like, that's pretty cool, like how this matches the steering wheel and then as well as the sticker will match the steering wheel when I put it in my car, the dash. And then I noticed the little horn that it came with was red, like that same chrome red. I just thought it was cool, like putting two and two together. I thought it was an original idea. So I'm gonna give huge credit to Osteezy. You're an amazing designer. I hope one day, like, if I ever start my own thing, I can meet you, talk to you, and hopefully collaborate with you, man, because this stuff is legit. I love car stuff. Most people, some people collect shoes, some people collect, you know, different things. I collect car parts. I think it's cool. That's what I want to do. And second package just came in yesterday the never content from Ostezu website I was telling you guys about uh, came in yesterday I don't know what time I was at work I opened and closed full shift so I had no clue that they would even be coming in today uh, someone had left them on my desk it was late when I got home so I wasn't I didn't really want to do it at night I was like might as well just wait for the morning but before I head off to church I want to open them up check them out and show you guys yeah let's check them out so I got the Paws off, never content, Pikachu. So it says on the back, which is pretty cool about it. Um, and then this little brand name, the logo on the front. And then I got another package as well. I'm not gonna open this one up yet. That is for another time. Let's go with just opening these up for right now. And then here on the back, let's you know what's uh, what it's all about inside this package. So I'm gonna get some scissors right now, give me one sec. Okay, this is a lot bigger than I expected it to be. This Pikachu is giant. I don't even know. That's big. It's pretty cool though. So this is Never Content. It says Late Night Fun, and then it's got like some Chinese or Japanese writing. Forever Style. Um, 
I actually really like this material. This is super nice. It's got like a matte finish. It's not like that cheesy clear coat they always put on stickers that like peel. That's super nice. This one has that clear, but still, still feels like good quality. I thought I was gonna slap that on my computer or something or save that for later, pause off. I just like that design. And then it comes with a little, ooh, that's pretty legit. That's pretty cool. It's got a nice colorway on his little business card. Thank you for ordering, kind of deal. And then that's his at name. I was gonna throw that in the description, but might as well just show it right now. Ostezy, never content. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Just these three stickers, and I will show a little more depth of the steering wheel and these stickers together in this short little edit. Enjoy. Thank you.